This is our last video in the Book Creator series, and just um, so you can kind of see what it looks like on a Mac. If you, the teacher, you know, want to see um, some of the books that your students have shared with you through Google Drive, this is how you would do it. So, like I said, um, at Pastor, we just created a folder that I share with the entire staff, and we just kind of arranged it um, d d different levels. So, I'm just going to pick a book in the first grade reading one, and I'm just going to pick one uh, called American Symbols. And this is an EPUB, which means I can, I can read it, you know, on my MacBook, on my um, iPad. There will be interactivity with it. If, if there's audio or, or video, you can do that. Now, the next thing you have is, um, you know, connect more apps. I'm just going to hit the download. And right now, it is downloading this to my MacBook. And as you can see, it's finished, and it's down here in the bottom left. And then I can click on the arrow, and I can open it. And right now, it is opening in iBooks. And here you go. Uh, and it actually will leave off the page that, that you've um, finished at. So as you can see, here are here is my book um, that I have actually um, had in my Google Drive. And if I want to get back to the other books that I have, here are some of the other texts that I have in my iBook library. And then if I want to get another book, you know, let's go back here and let's do Black History Month. Hit download. Download anyway. And then when it's finished downloading, you can just double click and it will open it in iBooks. So this is one way that you can see how to um, you know, read a text that your students have created on the iPads and how to see what it looks like um, on your MacBook. And like I said, once you double click on it, it will open. And here's uh, my um, ebook on Black History Month. Thank you, and um, hopefully you've enjoyed listening to the videos on Book Creator.